things are possible now. Today is the day of salvation. Today is the day of change. Today is a new day. Today is the day that I want to move in you supernaturally today. We need to allow this revelation to come alive in our lives as the solid foundation, the compassion of Jesus that he had in the scriptures to fill you and suddenly you're going places and being with people that you thought you never could handle. We are the firstborn. We have rights. We are colleagues with the purpose. We are kingdom people. Don't sleep here in America because the world is looking at you. God has chosen you and prepared you for the nations. He's talking about the light of the revelation of who Jesus is. And he's just releasing uh, the revelation of who Jesus is. Everything has been transformed because of that word. It's no, he must increase. It's first about him. It's first about God. It's about loving him with our heart, soul, mind, and strength, and then loving our neighbor as ourselves. Because this is the generation that will see the greatest harvest like the church has never seen before, and see the demonstration of the power of God like the church has never seen before. Because you are the people that relentlessly pursue Jesus. You are the people that relentlessly pursue the lost. And because of that, you are relentlessly pursuing the destiny that God has for the church and for each one.